good eye and welcome to one of the coolest little restaurants on Sukhumvit Road, Bangkok, Thailand, right opposite Soya. Hey, what soy is, is this? I don't know. I'll show you exactly where I am before I leave. Now, I love this little restaurant and the new addition to this little restaurant is the famous northern curry soup, khao soy. Thank you. Kapun Kap. And I've ordered the beef cow soy at just 120 baht. And it has arrived. It has. And it looks pretty good. It does. The crispy noodles on top. And you can. A couple of little things you need to add. You will get a little <laughs> sliver of lime. In it goes. You want all that in there. You do. You give that refreshing little sliver of lime. You also have some pickled cabbage and what looks like to be chopped onion. Just tip it in. <laughs> Use your spoon to just give that a little stir. Wow! And before I eat, I will tell you that cow soy is one of the tastiest little dishes you'll ever eat in Thailand. And having it on the Sukhumvit Road is really good. You don't have to travel on an overnight train, mayhem, nightmare, to get to Chiang Mai to try this wonderful soup. Mm. <laughs> the beef is a little bit chewy, a little bit tough, but the flavours is absolutely wonderful. The coconut, the lime and the chilies that have taken that on really well. The crispy noodles. Mm. That is absolutely wonderful. Lots of coconut in there. That's really creamy. Got the lime and the chili. All those flavors coming through. And this is me having breakfast at one o'clock with my Leo to a company this wonderful traditional dish and what better than getting it central Bangkok mm. there is <laughs> additional curry chili chili in there Oh man. You can have dried chilies or you can have little marinated chilies in there. If this wasn't hot enough. It's not that hot by the way. It's just very tasty. Oh man it is. It's just and when you get these great big lumps of beef right there. That bit was really tender, really tender. Succulent lump of beef, which has obviously been marinated in that coconut and lime. Oh man, boom, an explosion of flavor in one's mush. And also, <laughs> whilst I'm sitting here enjoying my soup, you also have an epic table clearing. You, you can watch the guys at work, you can see people serving, people coming in. You can see taxi drivers, bike riders, all kinds of people coming in. Then this little soy. So it makes for a very entertaining place to just sit on the Sukhumvit Road, enjoying <laughs> wonderful food. 
love watching the world go by. Mm. Now I, I have eaten cow soy in Chiang Mai, repeating myself I know, more than once. So, let me give you the full verdict of how good this cow soy really is. It's every bit as good as any cow soy I've eaten anywhere else in Thailand. And it's nice with, this, with the combination of the soft noodles and the crispy noodles. They complement each other really well. Mm. And lime, chili, coconut, as we know, is just awesome. It's like a marriage in heaven. It is. It really is. Right, one more chunk of this beef. And it is, the, the, uh, they haven't, what's the right word? That is a proper chunk of beef. Mm. That is really nice and tender, very well marinated. And it's very much the highlight of Khao Sao soup is, is the flavours that beef take on. It takes on the, the lime, the coconut and the chilli much better than the chicken or the pork. That is why beef, cow soy, is always the outright winner wherever you go. It just takes on the flavours much better. And one day if they could introduce a bit of lamb, and get a bit of coriander in there. Mm. But that is, that is really good. Beef, that first bit I had was a bit grisly, but the rest, it's just like, it melts in your mouth. It really does. The combination, there's a dry chilli there. <laughs> it is getting a bit soupy as we go. So I've used, I'll now get on the spoon. Mm. That is, that is superb, that really is. Day one, back in Thailand, on the streets of Bangkok, climatizing, not just to the heat, the humidity. <laughs> Need them flip flops to walk, but also the, the magical flavours of Thai food. Wow, that is quite something. It's made it's, it's turned my day around, <laughs> it really has. Mm. That is quite something, guys. If you want to a really good breakfast, a really good start to your day. And if you're staying where I stay, just over there on Sawyer 8, you just nip into this restaurant. And I, can go, I can vouch for the food being very, very good, no matter what you order. But the cow soy, well, there you go. That's a brand new addition. And that is, oh man, that is a mouthful of flavor without being too hot. That is awesome. And succulent beef, that's a really good start to the day. It really is. So, I hope you've enjoyed the cooking cowboy. <laughs> and now you are going to have Mr. King giving you food reviews right across Thailand. I will be sticking my neck out, as per normal, trying to bring you something new each day, or something of entertainment. And that's really good. So I hope you've enjoyed this vlog as much as what I've enjoyed making it. Cheers. Chop the cap.
And until next time, bon appetit. <laughs>